Are we rolling? We're on? We're on? Is it live? Okay. So today on Hidden Secrets Revealed Live. Let's talk about real stuff. The nitty gritty. Stuff that matters, you know? So yeah, we talk about digital marketing. Which is the big subject. All right. I just got off a call with with someone who needs help with digital marketing. But I want to tell you why I told them to hold off. Okay, that's that's what this is about today. When to hold off. All right, so let's get started. Roll the intro. Uh. The idea is simple. Every day I go live for about 10 minutes. We talk about digital marketing. In the process, I reveal the hidden secrets of the universe. No extra charge. It's an added bonus. You're welcome. Sometimes we have te technical difficulties, but we get through it. We get through it. We always get through it. So today I had a call with someone who skipped out on their scheduled appointment with me. Yeah, it happens. It's one of the things that happens when you're trying to help businesses increase their revenue it's crazy out there. Sometimes people don't pay attention to the right things. See, what people fail to realize is when someone's trying to help you make money, if you put them off, you're putting off your income. You don't want to put off your income, do you? We want to increase our income. So here's what happened. A furniture store who we, we specialize, my agent, the agency that I partner with, this is called Pipeline Communications. We get our partners double their ideal customers in half the time it takes without our proprietary data. And we specialize in, in uh, retail and furniture stores like this this potential client here. So the client, the prospect, we had a meeting scheduled. He didn't confirm, so I knew it was going to happen. So I wait for him on the call. He doesn't show up. So did I... Panic? No, I actually didn't. I called him and got it, got a hold of him. And the reason he didn't show up, uh, of course he had a reason. It wasn't life threatening. There, no one was hurt or injured. He was just preoccupied. Now, when someone's preoccupied, they can't give their full attention to you. If you don't have their attention, you're not going to close the sale. So it was about 15 minutes into the time we had scheduled. And so I got him on the phone and he asked me, well, how long is this going to take? How long is your pitch? I'm like, wait, wait, wait a minute. Now, if you, um, if we had a call scheduled for, for 1215, then you would have been on time for that. But now we only have 15 minutes left. So what would you like to do from here? Because, because I'm not going to pitch you something that you don't want. 
not going to waste my time and yours. So that triggered him to actually explain what was happening with his business. And very fortunately, I found out a lot of information. He told me his, he revealed his budget. He revealed what was happening with his business. He revealed the supply chain issues. All the stuff that I would never have uncovered had had there been this, had he showed up for the scheduled call and we gave him the pitch because he even admitted he was just going to think about it and get back to us. So that's what he was looking for. He wanted to hear our pitch and he was going to think about it. So fortunately, I got that out of the way. See, it's better to just hold off with someone. So I found out what was going on with them. I'm like, look, let's hold off for two weeks because you got to get situated with what you're doing and I don't have your full attention. So let's reconvene in two weeks. Cause no, no skin off my back. It's his, re it's his money. It's his revenue. It's his dime. He, he wants, he needs to make money or he needs to do what he's got to do. So the lesson here is don't let people off the hook. If they don't show up, then don't let them off the hook. Like you confront them on it. And that will, that will save you trouble down the road when, when, the, when you find out they weren't going to take action anyway. You put it off for, for, for them. You're doing it for them. Like if you know you, that person's not ready, you know, come back when you're ready. Cause I can help you. I have what you need, but if you're not ready for it, I'm not going to push you on it. So that's the lesson. And, uh, I'm fully convinced that we'll end up the hero of the story because he needs, he needs our service and we'll get him the revenue. We'll get him the customers. But my point is don't let, don't let people ignore you. Call them out on it. If they're putting you off, believe me, you'll be so much better for it in the long run. So that's my show today. Just, uh, letting you know what's happening. What's happening with you? I don't want to be talking at you. Because that, that helps nobody if I'm just talking at you. So leave a comment and uh, I don't know what do you want, what do you, what should you leave a comment about? Um, I don't know, tell me a joke in the comments. How about that? All right. Anyways, I got to get back to work. All right. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Be amazing. I have spoken. <laughs>